Today I'm going to show you how you can leverage Sora 2 and NA10 workflows to generate videos automatically. Specifically, we're going to be generating a very specific type of videos that is the Ring doorbell videos. You can see how viral these doorbell videos have been going. And I'm going to show you how to use this workflow to get completely for free on the first link down below in the description. Generate these kind of videos using Sora 2. Before we begin, if you're interested in learning more stuff about NA10, I have a free school community on the link down below in the description with an NA10 course that you can act completely for free with all of the prompts and workflows inside there. But if you just want to get this workflow and test it out and run it, you can go on the first link down below in the description that says Gamro. Download it, it's a JSON file, you open up a new workflow on NA10, click the three dot, import from file to import the workflow, and then you have to do two things to set it up. First of all, you want to get an API key from Google AI Studio. You open it up and you go over here that says get API key, create an API key and your good to go. Then what you want to do is come on the workflow, click on the Google Gemini chat and connect your credentials. Super easy. Second thing is you want to get a file AI key so you can use the Sora 2 API through them. It's also very, very simple to do. Let me show you how to do it. First of all, you go into manage API keys and you generate key. Then you come here, click create authorization header, write authorization here, capital A, that's very, very important. And then key with capital K, paste, and then paste your, it's that simple guys. And the whole workflow is is going to be working for you. The only thing you need to do is write on the chat over here your prompt that is going to be processed by the mod. For example, here I have a ring camera video of a man on the porch with a black beard sniffing him, blah blah blah. The AI agent has been already set up for you. Take your input choice and create free that will be generated by Sora. Now, after you test the workflow, you could go to the pro version of Sora 2 by typing here on the URL on the generate video node slash pro. This is going to cost a lot more than what I use by default on this workflow but again that's if you want to do professional quality videos like this post on the internet and earn money but for demonstration purposes today i'm just using the simple version sora 2. also one thing that i should note is that you cannot use kids in the prompts because the model is going to fail so that's something that you need to know it's highly gated right now as a model so that's one negative that it so you are pretty much ready to go you have all of the information you need you have the school community so you can try everything out and let me navigate into Sora 2 Pro to show you the workflow and how you can set it up and give you a little bit of an understanding behind the scene. First of all, when you select the model you want to use, like some Sora text to video with what we're doing, you can see here your prompt that are running at the moment. So you can see here my prompt takes a lot of time. I really have no idea why the model takes five minutes to generate my video. I really don't get it. Maybe the you know stress of the servers, but if you do a failed request like I have done for the pro version while testing it out, you are going to see on the request tab a failed message. If you get a 200 message here, like we see over here, it's success and your workflow should run end to end. At the end of the workflow, you get the video URL, which you can then download or do whatever you want with it. Maybe straight go upload it to a channel or your social media. And yeah, this is the workflow. It works very simply. And I want to show you really the result of this prompt. Uh, if Sora 2 finally, you know, goes ahead and generates the video for us, like you can see here, it's still in progress. I really don't know why, but I'm going to be waiting for file AI to generate my own video. So I saw with you. Now, a lot of people will ask me, okay, Iro, I really don't want this kind of doorbell videos. You can go inside the AI agent and change prompt. You don't have to use my own prompt. You could specify a different specifically system message. That's what you want to do if you do a change, or you can just change your initial prompt that put on the chat interface. The idea here with the chat interface is that put like prompt you want to generate and the AI agent goes and up. Now, a lot of people will ask me about about all of the other fields here are they interesting are they important well the generated video tab is going to generate the video the video is going to take some time to get generated and you will be able to download it after a couple of minutes so i have added a wait flag and check check if the video url is ready the request is ready and when the request is ready you are just going to get the url so it's really that simple you could add some more note here like blotato so you can directly upload the video to your social media account but i'm not doing that here because my goal is just show you this work so again it's very very simple simple to set this workflow up. You really just have to connect your API keys and the total cost for running this workflow. Let me show you exactly how much. For the simple Sora model, it's about $0.1 per second generated. Our generation, I really don't know how big it's going to be. Uh, probably, you can probably tune in through the API provision here. If you check input, you can specify how long it's going to take. I have put four seconds thing, which is the default, but you can specify it on the generated video tab here. Some new body parameter like 
uh, if you see, let's show you how you can. So you can type resolution and put 720p as a new parameter. You can add the ASP ratio, five gas ratio, and you can also set the duration up to 12 seconds, which is of course going to take more time than the four seconds. Of course, it's going to cost you about $1.2 with a simple Sora Tech Video version. Now for the Pro version with Tech to Video Pro, the cost increases significantly, especially if you do 1080p videos, about 50 cents per second. So it's five times more and three times more for the 720p. But if you want to do this professional and generate high quality videos, I would highly suggest that you go with it because that's what's going to allow you to get the best quality possible in the final request. And I really don't know what's going on with Fall AI at the moment. Like I really am waiting to see my video. And finally, we got it. We finally got the video. So here is the URL. You can click on the view tab and view the video. Okay, so this is very low quality right now just because I use the very cheap model. But let's check it out. <laughs> it hits the bear on the face and the bear is gone. But what I really like about this is that the quality is really what you would expect from a ring doorbell video. But okay, I really like the video. You can see how nice it is. Of course, the aspect ratio is on a video resolution. So if you want to do this for TikToks and sort, you got to go ahead and specify the aspect. So here you want to add the parameter, get the input. So go aspect ratio, define the aspect ratio here and go 916. Easy as that. Boom and boom, you're good to go. It's that simple. For the simple version of Sora, it's always going to be just 720p. It's not going harder than that, higher than that. But okay, you get, I think, the idea. So you know what? Let me do one more generation just to show you the differences in the aspiration and all the stuff. And I'm going also to give you this updated workflow on the link down below. So you are getting bonus version just because I really love these kind of generation. I really, really like pros and I really think Sora 2 videos could absolutely cook. You can also preview here the request result from get video or whatever. And we can see that our request is in progress right now. So it's running. And yeah, that's going to take a little bit of time. So I will jump to the results. So I don't waste any of it. And boom, we finally got the video ready for us preview. So let's check it out. Oh, get out of here. <laughs> okay. Okay. So this is a oh, very nice get video. Out of here. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> Okay, I could actually see this going viral for sure. So yeah, make sure to check out Sora 2 workflow. I think you could make tremendously amazing doorbell videos going completely viral. It's going to be so funny. And let me know if you tried it, if you like it, if you enjoyed it. And I will see you on the